We're going to find it. Oh, there we are. Hey, how y'all doing? This is Rich Morris from Stabila. Look at it. We're up on the, the camera over there. You know, I don't know if you don't see this or not, but right to the left of the Jumbotron there, that's our new JLG 360 cam up nice. underneath there. So that's cool. we'll be able to get some that's shots. Cool. I wonder if they could do that. Can you guys actually take a look at it? There's the JLG cam. Can you swing over here to the Stabila tent? Look at this. Watch this. Watch this. Yeah, this is He's cool. going all the way around. There, there we are. Wave. Can you see us? There we are. So we got the JLG cam right here on the, oh look, we get a close up too. Oh, that's awesome. Sweet. There we, there we are, Rich. There we are. That's awesome. Hey man, how you doing? Doing well, doing well. Uh, just excited to be here again, 2024. You guys Love are it. awesome, man. Everybody Thank loves the levels, you know. I mean, they're the best in the business. They really are. Yeah, I got something uh, really important to say. Okay. Uh, we're still the number one proven brand for Masons. But, Woo! I'm good with that. So if you're laying brick or block, the top vial and the bottom vial are matched. So you don't have to pick between one or the other and what's accurate. They're guaranteed for life. Okay. If I turn the level upside down, that's called bottom read, or you got top read, the level reads the same. I challenge any manufacturer in North America to come to us after five years that their level's still accurate. We guarantee ours for life. I like that. Yeah, we stand behind it. So you got four choices. Okay. You've got, you got our classic. All right. Then you have this profile that has rare earth magnets. So think about taking your level and put it right on the side of a scaffold. You don't have to worry about a hook. I like that. Got our Mason's level. We, we actually started the category to actually put blow shields on a level that could actually be struck with a trowel. Uh, before it was owned by the wood business, but we've since gained that market share. And I'm proud to say we still dominate that compared to any other level out there. All right. And then you go to the R-beam. The R-beam is 120% stronger than any other traditional level out there. It's one continuous handle. It's built for extreme duty. And remember, all of our levels could take that one story impact and still read accurate. Oh, wait a minute. So I could, like, throw the level and it'd be fine? You could do it as many times as you want. Go for it. So that's my camera guy right like there. I'm going to throw it right over go. his head. There you there go. There you go. Would somebody grab that, please? And I want to come back here and see and make and, sure it works. And, and, and what's, what's great about that, what you just did, that test right there. When it takes a fall test, if you did a competitor, right. the vials be laying in somewhere in the parking lot. The vials are still firm, solid into that frame. They're bonded 100%. Wow. So, can you, can get a, you can get a look at that right there and that, that bubble right there. That thing is just perfect. That's, that's incredible. Thank you. Absolutely incredible. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, you know, it's man. always a pleasure. Oh, but, we're not uh, done yet. We're not done yet. I want to know what's going on here go. with the so, challenge. So all day, there are two guys here, Connor and Eric, have been talking a little smack once another. Right. And uh, who's actually stronger? Who's going to do the most? So I said, let's, let's just call it a day. Okay. They're going to have bragging rights. So they're going to do this yard beam. They're going to do the dip challenge. Most dips go. I'll pay them 100 bucks. Go. Go. Yeah, two. He's shaking already. Count it out. Count Three, it out. Three. Four. He's one ahead. No. Five. No. I think that's pr Eric. Little Eric, guy versus Eric. big guy. Come on, Connor. Come on. Don't Come stop. On. Nice job, Connor. You got this. He's done talking. Eric, bow to him. Give him a high five. Let's go. All right, that's it. You You're, don't, good. Yeah. You're good. You're good. You're good. You won. You got it. Woo! Nice job. Nice job, man. Ladies and gentlemen, the offspring of Rick Astley right here. Uh, hey, it's worth a, a C note. Nicely done. You did a good job. Rich, thank you so much. Everybody, come on over here. Take the challenge, right? Yeah, right on. We got, uh, what do we got uh, for our big winner? Free goods? We got three level set, which will basically, you can pick any set you want, but then we'll send it. You don't have to worry about taking it on the airplane. I love it. Stabila, that's what you want when you're working. Come see Rich and his group over here. Thanks, everybody. Good luck tomorrow. All right, we'll be right back back. Jacob, how are you? I'm good. Good to see you. Good to see good you to again. Back. Jacob Mendoza, he is with Kubota. And uh, where's our other guy? Come on in here. We, we, we don't have a microphone for you. You guys are going to have to share the mic as far as what's going on. But, you know, I've got to tell you that this particular machine, these guys are just like, this is the machine I want. And they, like, everybody is just like, I got to have this. I got to build the best wall. They are just enamored with this puppy right here. Why is this thing so amazing? Why does everybody want it? Well, that's a great question. I think first and foremost, it's a customer centric design, right? So we start with who that potential customer is and then figure out what exact specs would be perfect for them. And what's better for these types of customers than a long bed? It's also made from steel, it's got a bed liner, you got the diesel engine, the VHTX transmission, and you got a machine that's willing to work as hard as they do. You know, and this, I'd have to say that this machine is darn near perfect and that's what it takes 
to win this machine, you know, for the top craftsmen to get the wall like that. So if you build the best wall, that perfect wall, you're going to get the perfect machine for the job. That's absolutely right. You know, now what are we going to see out here today? We're going to have a little demonstration because you not only have this, but you have another machine sitting behind there as well. Correct. It's not brand new like the uh, X1130, but we have the SCL1000, which is our stand-on machine, 1,000 pounds of lift capacity, 36 inches wide, but 36 inches wide with a white track. So not only do you have great flotation, you have great flotation going through a small garden gate. All right, well, let's see him do that right now. I know you've got some quick crate bags positioned on there. Let's watch him pull that off of the 1130. Now that's nice and easy to operate. You got a stand on machine right there. Correct, and it's got a patented T-handle control. If you've never operated any kind of track loader before, very intuitive to use. All right, Jacob, grab the microphone. Let's go inside here real quick. Because yeah, absolutely. I, I want to sit inside here, and you know, we, it's, it's a simple machine, but it's got everything you want. It's extremely comfortable. Um, let's go over what we've got here in the front. Yeah, in the front, you know, you've got intuitive controls, operator or ease of operation is one of the critical things, right? So anybody on the job site or anybody in, in where you're working is able to come in and operate it with ease. I mean, that's important because that's what you want. You don't want things that are complicated. Right. I want it easy. I want to be able to get the job done with no issues and go, hey, I can't do it. You, you're going to take it and you're going to do the job. Right, and then what excites me the most about this product is not just the long bed, but it also has the most cargo capacity of any of the models we've ever introduced. So it's a little over 1,200 pounds, and it comes with Pro Convert, which means you can open it from the sides, open it from the tailgate, fold all three sides down, or completely remove them for a flatbed configuration. What can, how fast can this thing go? I mean, if I, if I got to get somewhere, what kind of speed can I be safe in this machine? We're looking at right around 27 miles an hour. Okay. Hey, that's good enough to get you across the farm. That's right. You know, if you got to get something done, you get on the job site, that's more than enough horsepower that's for right. this machine. Yeah, and I think the, the big thing, too, is the hydraulic power steering allows you to go through a variety of terrain or transition from a sidewalk to a road with ease, because much like a tractor, it's going to hold kind of the direction that it's going. All right, well, come see Jacob and his group. Uh, they'll be out here uh, for the next couple of days, and, you know, they can hop in here. You can watch them do that as well. And uh, we appreciate it once again. Like I said, when, when the uh, Masons and Tenders are over there building that wall, they're like, I want the Kubota. I mean, they're like, it, it is game on over there. I love that. Well, we're very happy to partner and support such an amazing event. Good luck to all the competitors, and we look forward to seeing you throughout the week. Thank you very much, Jacob. Kubota, we appreciate it very much. This is one heck of a machine, and uh, good luck to all the teams that are out there. We're going to take a short break. When we come back, we're going to talk about some of the tools that they use from our good friends at Marshalltown. So don't go anywhere.